we're ready now to make the pudding to go with our tombstone pudding dessert. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to just slightly whisk the eggs. And I'm not going to need to do it very much because I'm using the, the egg whites that come in a carton. So I have my egg whites in the bowl and I just want to make sure it's whisked up slightly. And I'm not trying to create a lot of volume, I'm just making sure they're well mixed up. And that's all there is to that. So I can set that aside till we're ready for the egg whites. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to mix together the cocoa powder and the cornstarch. So I'm going to go ahead and just put, dump that in there. And then I'm just going to whisk these together. Now to this, I want to add 3 fourths cup of my milk. And then I'm just going to stir this together until it's all mixed up. And it's a smooth mixture. We're starting to get it mixed in. It's not all the way there yet, but we're getting there. We're starting to get some of that shiny stuff. And it's starting to dissolve into it. I just want to keep whisking this until it's all dissolved and it's smooth. And you notice I'm scraping the side to the bowl too. Okay, that is smooth. We're now ready to go over to the stove and start cooking our pudding. In my saucepan, I'm gonna put the rest of my milk and my trivia. and salt. And I'm going to bring this to a boil over a high heat. While that's coming to a boil over the high heat, I do want to whisk it continually. Because we don't want this burning to the bottom of the pan. So I'm going to whisk this and I'll be back and show you what we do after this comes to a boil. I put the chocolate into here, and then I put it back onto the heat, and I'm bringing it to a boil. And once it comes to boil, which you see right there, it is boiling, I'm going to let it boil for two minutes, whisking it constantly. Don't know where my camera turned off. I noticed it was off, so let me just explain where, what I did to cover anything that might not have happened. I had the water and the trivia in there. It came to a boil. I removed it from the heat. I add the cocoa mixture to it, and then I turn the heat down to medium high instead of high, and I put this back on the heat, and now I kept whisking it till it came to a boil. And now I am whisking it while it boils for two minutes. When it's done cooking those two minutes that I'm whisking it, I will then take it off the heat again, and we're going to add some of it to the egg whites and whisk it in. And then we will add the egg whites back to this mixture. But this boiling is going to help bring the chocolate to be nice and thick because it's got the cornstarch in it. All right, this is boiled for two minutes and I'm going to remove that from the heat. I have my egg whites that I whisked. Now I want to pour just about a cup in and not more than that. Just a little bit, about that much in. Then I want to whisk this quickly because I don't want the egg whites to cook. This is tempering the egg whites, getting them ready to go into that. Now when I put this back on the heat, this pan here, I don't want it to come back to a boil. But I'm going to put it back on, on the heat after I dump this back into the pan. So I've got that tempered in there. Now I'm going to whisk this into that pan. Get it all in there. Okay. 
And now we want to cook this again on medium high heat, whisking continually, but we don't really want it to come to a boil. Once we're sure that's mixed in really well and we can feel it's thickened up a little bit, which it's about there, we're going to remove it from the heat again and add the vanilla. So I'm going to remove that from the heat, turn the heat off, get my vanilla, add it in, and just whisk it. Now, all we need to do, we don't want to put this in the bowl yet because it's really hot. So we're just going to let this sit in the pan. Oh, for about 15 minutes, 20 minutes, half an hour till it's cooled enough that we can put it into our bolts. And I'm going to whisk it every few minutes because I don't want it to get a film on top. So we'll let that sit. 